So I'm just gonna start here. I have a little bit of bread flour here. Um, and I'm just gonna dust this a little bit. And then I have this kind of worked into a rectangle. And then I'm just gonna kind of roll this out. And basically what I'm trying to do is get it thin enough to go through our largest setting here uh, in the pasta machine. You want it to be thin enough so that it doesn't bunch up. Sometimes if it's too thick, you can get your pasta will just kind of clump up on you and, and tear, which you don't really want. And always just yolks, never full eggs? So I do, for this recipe actually, I do 13 uh, egg yolks and two whole eggs. Oh wow, yeah. and how much flour are we talking? 18 ounces. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I just about have this thin enough. And so we're just gonna come right over here and we're gonna just start kind of cranking it through. Usually this first spin um, is kind of the toughest. Okay. All right. And you're gonna keep this in one big long sheet or are you yeah. gonna cut this? So I'm actually gonna keep this in one long sheet. Wow. It's really nice to have this really nice perfect sheet without tears on the side. Sure. And so one of the things that I've learned over the years, because we've rolled a lot of pasta, <laughs> um, what I like to do is Take this, flip it right around. Whoa! All right. That just blew my mind. <laughs> <laughs> so usually what I do is I'll try to go through each setting twice. All right, and I'll do that one three times just because we kind of added that to it. You just changed my pasta yeah. making game so, forever. 